next trailer I've got coming up is another one that, uh, or another movie that Shia LaBeouf is playing in. It's called Honey Boy. I'm going to assume this is a drama because it just sounds like it and the thumbnail, which was just a picture of his face, he looks like he's got longish hair. It just kind of made me feel like it's a character drama. So that's not really my thing. But because this is the second Shia LaBeouf movie that I've seen, um, uh, not that I've seen, but that I know is coming out this year or trailer of, of it, I'm going to check this out and see what it's all about. Oh, he wrote it. What am I being arrested for? Huh? You think you're hot? Cause you don't know how good I am at what I do. This is strange. I see you. Country real hard. Be a twelve-year-old. Pie fight. Ugh. It's not a pie fight. Think it through. What your mother got a job for? Just in case. In case what? I don't. In case you fail. In case it don't oh. work out. Yes, man. She's filling your head full of fear. I pump you full of strength. Cause we're on a team, and I know you got what it takes. You're a star, and I know it. That's why. He looks I'm so here. different like that. I'm your cheerleader. Oh my god. <laughs> to talk about my dad good take good take you did it you did it good job everybody my dad's not the reason to drink he's the reason i work I'm I have good instincts. Yeah, I got have rodeo have clown instincts. instincts, so I could never make it in Hollywood. You could if you started when I did. How do you think it feels to have my son paying me? How do you think that feels? You wouldn't be here if I didn't pay you. Oh, it's an Amazon original? Oh, okay. It's coming to theaters November 8th. So, I was reading some of the comments before I started watching it to try to figure out what this is about. And some people were saying that it looks like it's it's a um, like an autobiography-ish type of film about Shia, his I guess his childhood, his or his his time acting from a young boy to you know through his adult years and when he uh, gets into trouble with the law and it seems to me like that might be accurate I haven't read anything further about it other than just these things that I was skimming through and I'm wondering it seeming to me that um, Shia excuse me, that Shia is maybe playing the part of his Father, if this is sort of supposed to be an autobiographical story, I'm getting the feeling that he's playing his father in here. And I don't know really enough, or I don't remember enough about Shia's history, his biography. I, I'm, I'm having some vague memories of knowing that there were some issues maybe when when he was younger and of course he you know we all know the rocky times he's gone through um so i i don't you know i'm not sure how much of this is really based on reality or or, or what i i don't know maybe i should read some about uh, his background a little bit more or maybe I should also just read a synopsis of this to get an idea I mean he wrote this so that's why it's making me think 
that the people in the comments section who have observed that this seems like an autobiography, they're probably on to something. Um, the kids acting in here, yes, it's very good. There was some sort of clip it or text that went across the screen referencing his acting, the child acting, and he's, he's very, it was very good. Um, compared to Peanut Butter Falcon, I'm feeling more of a draw to Peanut Butter Falcon, and I'm thinking maybe it's because it seems to me like it's going to be more of a feel-good movie, more of a happier type of outcome, I hope. Um, I haven't seen it yet. Like I said, it would suck if it had a sad ending after you get all invested in the characters. This looks like it's just going to be sad to me. Um, I don't know. I, I'm not sure if I feel like I want to invest emotional energy in watching this. So what I might do is just read a summary of it, find out how it ends. The trailer itself felt like it was a bit on the long-ish side, and there were some parts of it that were confusing. I had no idea what was going on in some of the scenes. It just seemed a little surreal. It was just under 2 minutes and 10 seconds, so not the longest trailer I've watched on here before, but it was kind of on up there, and it felt like it really didn't need to be. But I mean, it's, it's, not, it's also not the worst I've ever seen in that regard. So, you know, not, not really huge, huge complaints about the trailer beyond that. And just feeling kind of a little bit leery of the movie in general. Not because I think there's going to be any bad acting or, or anything like that. Um, because I know Shia is a good actor, and this kid in here, he obviously is very clearly a good actor just from the little that I can see but just because I don't know what kind of mood this will put me in and I have to be in the right mood to see something that I think is going to put me in a mood so like you know a melancholy mood that that sort of thing mm. so I don't know we'll see maybe I'll change my mind but I'm not I'm not sure about that if I do change my mind and if I do watch it I will return here and make a comment or, or two about it so, okay, well, that's it for this one, you guys. Bye.